case briefs and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. The United States District Court for the Northern District of California presided over a contentious case, Jewel v. National Security Agency, in 2013, which centered on the United States government's ability to withhold information under the state secrets privilege, especially regarding domestic surveillance under the Foreign Intelligence Surveillance Act, FISA. The road to the courtroom began with allegations of warrantless wiretapping and surveillance programs since the devastating attacks of September 11, 2001. Two class-based lawsuits challenged the National Security Agency's surveillance practices, arguing that such efforts breached individual privacy rights. The plaintiffs embodied in these lawsuits, referred to as Jewell and Schubert plaintiffs, contested the government could not utilize the state secrets defense to preclude information disclosure related to domestic surveillance under FISA. The court agreed with the plaintiffs, ruling that the state secrets defense was overridden by FISA. This marked a notable victory for those advocating for insight into the surveillance practices of the executive branch of the government. However, the lawsuits faced an obstacle in the form of sovereign immunity, which ultimately led the court to dismiss the plaintiff's claims for damages and relief. Despite this setback, the defendant's motions for summary judgment regarding the remaining non-statutory claims remain undetermined. The court is seeking briefings to clarify the scope of FISA preemption on the plaintiff's constitutional claims and determine whether the potential threat to national security outweighs the necessity to explore the alleged government program. The outcome of this case lies in an intricate balance between national security and constitutional rights, as the court's decision continues to hang in the balance. Case briefs and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. Visit lse.law, elevate your mind. Leave the stress of class.